Dark Arm battle has been going strong for over 8 years now, and while a lot of the game has changed significantly, the gameplay has remained relatively the same. I believe it's time for some long overdue mechanic changes. Here are some that I think would work in Dokkan. Firstly, taking inspiration from Dragon Ball Heroes isn't actually a bad idea in my opinion, so I think that modes like Super Slash Mode and God Kamehameha are really nice. And I think that these are modes that would work very well in Dokkan. If you're unfamiliar, Super Slash Mode works as the name suggests. You have a character that has a sword or some other kind of ability like Vegito does, and they engage in a flurry of slash attacks against their opponent. And this just works by swiping at the screen or in the play area. And this is where I think it could translate to Dokkan, because if you implement the same or similar type of mode, you can simply just swipe at the touchscreen. Perhaps Dokkan can adopt a similar style to Heroes, where many characters can use this sort of mode, but each have their own different abilities. For example, one might lower defense, one might lower attack, and so on. This is a similar sort of justification with moves like the God Kamehameha. In this mode in Heroes, you charge your key by swiping up and down rapidly. After that, you form a letter G by swiping at the screen. And this is again where I think it could translate pretty well into Dokkan, because it might not need to be exactly like the God Kamehameha, but it can be something quite similar to it. Now moving away from Dragon Ball Heroes, you could obviously have stuff like more timed inputs into the game. Now the thing with that is, there's already one particular mode that has that, Dokkan mode. However, it can be implemented more into the game in sort of the style that Legends has done it with the uh, full power rush, I believe it's called, with the melee attack being that you have to time your inputs in order to deal more damage. Perhaps Dokkan can implement this in such a way where it makes normal attacks more effective. Because at the moment, I don't see too much that's really special by doing non-super attacks, which is kind of reasonable, but just something to think about there. Finally, I think that implementing the similar style of transformations that Dragon Ball Heroes has would be very interesting to see. What I mean by this is that in Heroes, you swipe up and down rapidly, or move your cards in a certain manner to charge up key, or to transform. And you can have three stages with this. The first is failure to transform, the second is a great, where it's just a regular power-up. The third is a is a full power one called Amazing. So I think at the end of that you get a little bit of a bonus if you're lucky enough to get that full power transformation. You also have transformation rushes, which I don't think I can show for copyright reasons. But essentially they're just characters that go through multiple transformations and end up at a final really big form. Perhaps it's the case that Dokkan can implement these with the next Heroes collaboration or with just another random unit, who knows. But those are just some mechanics I think that could be really nice when implemented into Dokkan, making the gameplay feel more fresh. What do you guys think? What mechanics do you want to see? Let me know in the comments below, smash like and subscribe and have a good one.